Hi friends, welcome to Samara Bot tutorial. Today we are moving on to online store. How you can create online store website using Samara Bot. If you don't have the app before, quickly go on to Play Store and install the app. It is called Samara Bot. And after that, you click on the second option we have here. You can see free website builder. And uh, when you click on this, it will tell you to create a website. It's a very simple step. You follow the step, create a website. Now after that, it show you two links one for your website and the other one for the website manager so you can manage your website from this app and if you want to use a um, web browser to manage your website there is no problem you go to manager.service.com and under your website manager scroll down to the settings then you see your manager id after that you provide the manager id here so it take you to your website manager from the web you can see it here now to create website um, online store, let me firstly check my website. Now this is my website. When you create website automatically, Samara will add some demo contents there. So you could come straight to user portal. Then from the menu here, click on admin settings, select online store, then you click on update. When I click, you can see all we have here. So let me just refresh. You can see. So I have what product here. Good. But all about this other menus, you don't want other menus like this. So you can remove them. Go back to this place and come straight to settings. We have menu settings. These are our tutorials. You may see blog on your own. So on my own, I have. Uh, blog i have uh, our tutors so let's refresh good so everything is in order now now what about i want to add this is product so you can add as many as you want so let's go back to user portal this is user portal now for the menu you can see what i have here so if you want to add product go back to website manager then click on product from this place you can add product and you want to add services maybe you want our services to show on your website this is how to do that click here settings menu first menu text change to services then scroll down menu visibility services visible after that you save when you save, refresh this your website, you can see we have um, services. So let me click on it. So there's the list of services. You can edit all the services or you delete them, add new ones. Okay. Now after that, your your um, customers they can actually let me log out because I've logged in before. They can actually log in from your website to purchase anything. Like for example, this is what you are selling. So let me click on buy now. When I click on buy, it tells me to log in first. So I have a account before. Let me log in. So I've logged in. I can go for shopping. It's only one product we have. So I click on this place. Now, pay on delivery. So that means by default, um, your platform will be pay on delivery. So how can you now make people, if I order it now, it will be, so, it will be successful. Because it is not like payment because it is pay on delivery. So if you want to change to online payment, go back to your website manager, click on user portal, come to the menu here and click on um, store setup. You can see pay on delivery. So change to online payment. Then here go to paystyle.com. This is paystyle.com. When you go to pista.com login, when you log in, go straight to settings. If you don't have an account before, create accounts. So once your account is approved, log in, go to settings. If you don't see settings, okay, let me. If you don't see settings, check settings on top around here. You see settings when you log in. Now after that, go to API. Um, API. So when you get to API, you see what you copy. It is called public key copy it here live public key this is only test live public key copy it here so you look for another one secret key you see it's live secret key copy it there so 
you click on save after saving it now like the customer so let's assume this is customer so customer want to purchase again so you can see this now online payment so if i this thing is the shipping fee is this so let me just click on order you see it's taking me to payment so it is now accepting online payment for this product good another settings you may like to change you can see you can check your cups and customers you can check new orders you have and uh, messages your customers send to you so that is simple way and other the you go to the website manager here other are very explainable they are simple to handle thanks for watching